how to create a table using the gravity forms list fields. So are you looking for a method to create tables with gravity forms? When you have multiple sets of values that share a direct relationship, tables are useful for displaying and visualizing information. I will show you how to use the list field to add a table to a form in this video. So the gravity form list field allows you to add a table with multiple columns into your form. The user can add and remove additional rows of information from each field using the list field. The end user can define a variable list of data or multiple field values. So go to Gravity Forms Visual Editor to add a table to your form. Now, drag and drop the list field into your form. So the field label is shown on the front end when users fill out a form you've embedded on your site. So let's enter information as our field label. You can also add a description. Then select the enable multiple columns checkbox. So you can add multiple columns here. So in the column boxes, I'll add So the plus icon allows users to add more rows. So as a result, this is how the list fields three columns look in the front end. Now set the maximum number of rows that users can add. For example, five. So if you want this field to be required, just check this box right here. You can also customize the appearance and the advanced settings of this field. So now let's save the form and review it. So let's try to add five columns. So you can see that users can create informative tables by allowing multiple columns on this field. So after adding more rows and filling the data, it looks like this. That's all. Thank you for watching.